Today, I'm going to show you how to do the multiplication sums. Our sum here is 32 times 5. And counting in fives for 32 times is going to be way too long. So I can use a method to get the answer. Well, usually with all our other methods, when we did the plus and the minus, we decompose the second number. But when we do multiplication, we decompose the first number. Now the first number is 32. So when I decompose it, I get 30 for my tens. And for my units, I get 2. Right, so my first step is to multiply with my tens. So my tens here is 30. So I can say 30 times 5 equals. Okay, so counting 30 times in fives will take too long as well. So I can use a trick to get this answer. I can put my finger to hide the zero. So now my sum reads 3 times 5. And 3 times 5 is 15. But I can't forget to put my zero at the back because he can't just disappear. So 30 times 5 equals 150. Okay, now I must multiply with my units. My units is 2, so my sum is 2 times 5. And that is an easy one, 10. But now to get my answer, I have to add the totals of these two answers together. So 150 plus 10 equals 160. But my sum is not complete until I write it on top. So 32 times 5 equals 160.